All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you PS5 features of 2023. And as always, I'm not going to be wasting any time. We're just going to get right into it. So the first one is going to be for the trophy hunters out there. So if you're planning to earn trophies, if you are tracking some trophies, you can literally pin the trophy screen on the side while you're playing the game. Literally, you can play the game and track the trophies at the same time on the left side. So what this does is it will show you the trophy list while you're playing the game so all you have to do is you even have to open the trophy panel from the uh, home screen and then pin it to the side and literally it's really that simple you can exit the pin if you want to but if you want it simply go to the control center open trophies and pin it to the side and that's it and the best part is you can choose what side you want to be for me i'm comfortable it to be on the right side you can choose whatever side that you want and trust me it's helpful for the trophy hunters if you're really into it and now the next one is going to be so insane so you guys know ps5 doesn't have any internet browser but guess what you can have the internet browser really easy so you're gonna to have to go to messages and send any of the link to your friends so let's say i'm just gonna send google.com to myself so all you have to do is simply type www.google.com and once you click on send you can actually click on it so i'm just gonna send it to myself and there you go and once you click on it it will open google search engine and from here you can literally search up anything that you want basically ps5 can have a uh, internet browser you can resize it but you can also zoom in that's the main thing because it's going to be pretty small so zoom in but here things get really interesting so basically you can even watch videos so let's say if you want to watch videos on daily motion or anything basically you can open blogs playstation you can literally do whatever you want that you can normally do in an internet browser into ps5 and again ps5 doesn't have internet browser but by doing this you can have internet browser play videos and here is the thing for twitter people a lot of people were complaining that there's no twitter app for ps5 guess what you can go to twitter by using this trick and uh, you can have the twitter into ps5 and uh, trust me it's so simple if you send twitter link to your friend and click on it you will be able to get into twitter instantly by just using the messages so this one's one of my favorite one because you can have internet browser in ps5 which is that and now the next one is going to be a really useful hack in ps5 so you guys know you can use ps4 control on ps5 right but guess what you can use any usb controller on ps5 literally any usb control that you have lying around you can plug it in and it will be simply just plug and play that said you can use ps5 with any of the usb controller i'm using nikon revolution controller it's a pro controller and for the information this controller is made for actually ps4 but the main point is this controller is a usb powered controller not a wireless controller works flawlessly with ps5 on ps4 games and again these controls are going to be working on ps4 games not with ps5 games so any usb controller that you're going to use on ps5 are going to be only for ps4 games again those are going to be strictly for ps4 games not for ps5 games now this next one is actually pretty insane so there are some hidden settings that you don't know about in ps5 so if you go to control center and press option you get to rearrange these um these uh, icons right like whatever you want to use but there are some hidden settings that are going to be on the bottom so there's a broadcast one that you can enable and there's one with network and there's like a lot more you can enable depends on your console i have few enabled already so that's why uh, i'm only getting two to enable but you can have these hidden settings and also rearrange the um settings and now this next one is actually going to be so amazing so you can go to playstation icon and eject any disc that you have in your playstation so let's say if you don't know what disc you have simply eject it without even going onto the game so you can simply eject from playstation icon and this next one is you can start the game on your ps5 by using the mobile app so even though if your console is in rust mode you can start the game by just clicking one button in the playstation app and there's one more massive uh, feature like you know this one's actually a big one so if you have a screenshot if you take a screenshot onto your ps5 
you can get that screenshot directly into your phone so go to the phone app go to this uh captures option and you will get real time screenshots so it, it won't even take like seconds to get that screenshot into your phone if you want to send, send it to your friend if you want to post that screenshot simply open the app and you will have the screenshot that you have just taken in ps5 into your phone instantly now this next one is actually with the controller and the headphones so both are completely synced so you guys know you can mute the audio from the controller right so if you mute the audio mute the mic onto the headphone your controller is also going to show that your audio is muted on the headphone so this is actually a pretty good one like you know really small detail that i love about ps5 so both are completely synced and now this next one is going to be for the media so if you have any video into your usb drive you can simply plug in the usb drive and then you go to a media gallery and then you will be able to play any video directly from the usb let's say if you have a movie that's like 4k or anything you can directly watch from the usb into the ps5 so it's gonna be pretty straightforward go to media gallery go to usb and play any of the videos that you want and uh, like i said you can transfer any of the videos to usb and watch it into your ps5 as a media player and this last one is actually gonna be one of the biggest ones so let's say if your friend have a game and that game you want to play as well your friend can actually share the game with you and play with you at the same time so i'm not talking about share play i'm talking about actual game so let's say this is my friend's account and i want to play that game in my ps5 so what you gotta do is you're gonna have to log into your friend's account and obviously you need to have crossed with your friend so once you log in your friend's account all you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to go to user and accounts and click on other and then you're gonna have to turn on console sharing from your friend's account so what this is gonna do is you will be able to download games from your friend's account and play it in your own account anytime that you want and you won't even have to log into your friend's account again so in my case i'm just gonna get the Witcher 3 ps5 from this account and you can do whatever game that you want that you have in your friend's account like you know your friend let's say your friend have god of war you want to play that game you can do it with the offline share and this is actually a pretty amazing ps5 feature that sony gave because like you know one person can buy the game and both of you can play the game no matter what game you have story mode whatever game that you have you can play both at the same time so i'm just gonna switch to my profile to show you that i will have that game in my account and again your friend can also play that uh, uh, like you know play that game whenever he wants to play in his account like literally in a different console i'm talking about i'm not talking about same console i'm talking about different console so you see the game is downloading in my ps5 and it's actually pretty insane so yeah these are the ps5 features of 2023 that you need to know and all of these features and hacks are pretty insane you need to use them in order to get like you know full potential of your ps5 hidden features so i hope you guys find this pro helpful if you did make sure to hit that thumbs up and by any chance if you didn't like the video you can hit that dislike button twice and as always i will catch you guys on the next one love you all peace out